Welcome back to Bros of Rides. On today's episode, I'm going to show you how to install this quick shifter brace. Got it from WeBike. All the instructions are in Japanese, so we're going to get into it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over the contents of this product. Just open it up. Like I mentioned, instructions are mostly in Japanese. So for the few English words on there, it does give a brief overview, uh, picture-wise, of what we're supposed to do. So I don't, I don't think we'll uh, be in too much trouble today. So here's the parts. Bolts come in a nice little package. And then the man of the hour, the actual brace. What I would have liked to have seen is an actual bearing right here instead of just a sleeve. That's definitely something in the future I'd like to take a look at doing, putting in a bearing in there. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and install it. So the first thing we're gonna wanna do is take off the quick shifter or the regular shifter. You have to take out the bolt all the way because there's a slot on where it rests. And you should be able to just slide it right off. Next thing we're gonna do is take off the other bolts that hold it in place, which is this one, and it should be this one back here. These two bottom bolts should be eight millimeters. Okay, the second bolt you're gonna need to take out is this one up here. Not the one below it. Inside the bag, we have our contents. We have a long bolt with a sleeve. That would be for the one back here. And then a shorter bolt with a smaller sleeve. That would be for the one up front. Let's go ahead and slide that in place just to get a good feel for it. Yeah, it's really nice. It'll have a little movement over time just from the shifter clinking in and out. If you've got the time before installing it, I would recommend getting a bearing put in place, machined out, pressed in. That's something I'll cover in a future video, but for right now, like I said, I'm just gonna go ahead and install it. So now we can go ahead and play around and see how this will work out. Slide over the shaft, go through that hole right there. Looks like the one's right about there. We need to really put these in place. While we then put the bolt through, and just, just get it started. Just need a couple threads. Same thing with the bottom one. Instruction said, make sure you get that piece of back in place. This little bracket for the quick shifter. Holds the command wire. Okay, so go ahead and thread that in, and there we go. Okay, the top bolts up here are five millimeter. One thing to remember when putting this back on, your quick shifter back on, there's two dots right here one tiny one one tiny one and you want those dots to make a straight line through your crush sleeve right here this might take a few tries back and forth okay then put your retainer bolt back in that 10 millimeter one you want to make sure you get a quick shifter right in that sleeve of the shaft. Okay, give it your last little tight. And there it is. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Bros of Rides. If you liked what you saw today here, please consider giving me a like and a subscribe. See you next time here on Bros of Rides.